First, open the side door. There are two screws placed on the right side of the panel of the machine. Grab the emergency power and pull it. You can put a screwdriver in between and pull it again. There's a pump. Please make sure that it is vibrating when the machine is running with water. If it is not vibrating, we have to take the pump out to clean it. Install it back and see whether it works or not. If it still doesn't properly work, you have to replace it with a new one. After taking the panel off, prepare a permanent pen. Please mark the tube that you will be disconnecting before you remove the components. It is better to mark a line between the tube and the seamed pipe so that you know that they are paired. Please disconnect them. Make sure to prepare some paper towels. Please disconnect the other one on the inside of the machine. Drain the water and clean the hoses. Since I marked one of the hoses, I know which one is paired with the pipe. Grab the pump and pull it upwards to take it out from the holder. There are two cables at the back that we have to disconnect. Make sure to mark one of them with the permanent pen too. You can disconnect the cables by pulling it out. Now, you just need to disassemble the pump. Just in case the water comes out, please put some paper towels underneath the pump. Use your permanent pen to draw some lines. You do this so when you assemble it back, you know which parts should be connected. We'll need a star-shaped screwdriver. There are four screws here. There are four more screws on the other side. Please remove all screws.
Please hold the top part while unscrewing. There are little pieces inside. There are small rubbers. Please make sure they stay inside the same spot. Grab some paper towels and clean the residual pieces inside. Please make sure that you hold the rubbers when you clean the other side. Please make sure to clean this part carefully. Sometimes the pump doesn't work when residue is remaining on the piece. Look for the lines that we drew to find the right pieces. Then, just put it back to where it was and close the top. Then, please put the screws back in. When you are done cleaning the pump, it is time to connect the cables again. Please, put the pump inside the machine first. There are two cables. Make sure to connect the cables to the pump. Match the lines that you made. Connect both tubes to the pipe. And push them away into the machine. Push the pump inside the pump holder so it grabs the pump tight. When everything is back in the right place, put the cover back and screw it.
If you want to check whether the pump works as well, please click this icon as shown on the screen. It will then adjust the fixture positioning to where the spray nozzles are aiming. Then, click this icon to initiate the pump. Once the pump starts working, water will come out from three different nozzles as you can see. Then, your pump replacement is complete. Thank you.